Hey guys, uh, so I know I'm in my garage a lot. A lot, of, pretty much all my videos lately have been in the garage because I've been in there working on the projects. But I keep getting messages asking about the T-Rex and how it's been performing and am, am I using it? And the answer is, yeah, we use it pretty often. My wife and I take trips once a once a month or so to uh, Rochester and Syracuse, different places. Uh, we have a, we have a newborn or. 13 month old now he's not new anymore but uh, we have a kid so we don't take too much too many further trips anymore but uh if you watch my other videos you'll see that i took it to chicago last summer and uh, definitely plan on using it uh, a bit more but um so we just took a trip up to my mom's house in rochester i thought i'd uh, take a video uh, so here it is i'm actually using a brand new gimbal that i just bought um it's the smooth four so my first investment into this whole YouTube thing, uh, kind of deal on Craigslist. So this is also kind of an excuse to use it and give it a try. Uh, so as you can see, it's really, really filthy. But here in New York, we have salt and junk on the roads. So we just drove, I can actually pull up the display, but uh, 117 miles, I believe. And everything went fine. It's, it's a trooper. It does really, really well. Uh, right now I'm charging it. house over there and inside I can show you how it's done all right I'm here in the car uh, 117.6 miles is how far we went uh, I have three little bars there on the gasometer uh, and then on my display that I have for my data in the in the pack on the car uh, you can see my voltage 316 uh, and I have 6.2 kilowatt hours remaining and you can see my state of charge and temperatures and stuff like that So when I left the house, I didn't do a full extended mode uh, just a regular mode um, And that's what I have left so six and then the display for my T-Rex stopped working I, I can't get the data off that for some reason. There's a little USB or um a dongle there that's just not working for some reason. Uh, so assuming I have double the 6.2, so 12 kilowatt hours remaining, um, I, I get about three to 3.5 miles per kilowatt hour uh, with this car. It'll be less in the winter because uh, the whole way here we used heat. I have snow tires on the car right now. So definitely not ideal conditions. It was snowing pretty hard. It was really windy for half our trip. Uh, so based on three to, we'll say three um, miles per kilowatt hour. So that would be around what, 30, 36 miles additional. So 117 plus 36 is about how much I have in an average winter conditions. Uh, it's been 20s. You can see the temperature right there. Uh, it's been 20s the whole way here. Um, so yeah, uh, I usually figure on around 140. In the winter and that's a safe number with using heat and the snow tires and everything um which is is pretty good it's it's a, a little bit more than i would get with the car alone in good conditions but yeah so that's the, the update on the uh the t-rex and me using it so yeah we use it it's been working great uh if you guys have any other questions uh or if you want me to build you one <laughs> just just let me know but thanks for watching 